Welcome to Soft Reviewed. In this video, I just want to show you like how you can use Google's Imagine 4 for free. For that, you need to come to this website lab.googlefx.tool/wisk. So we need to use this tool. This is a tool where you can remix different images and create image and animate it. The animate feature was introduced recently, earlier it was available without that feature where we can remix image. As you can see, when you load the screen, you will be presented with different images. If you want to create images like this, all you need is just to click on that image. And as you can see, you can click on this button, make be taken to the actual page where you can make further adjustment to that specific image. If you are wondering if it's available in your country, as of now, I, WISC is not available in India, Indonesia, EU, UK, Russia, Israel, Afghanistan and Bangladesh. And if you are from other countries, you can use it. Since I am from India and uh, if you want to use it, you will have to use uh, like a VPN service. I am using right now since I am from India. Yeah, once you have the VPN, you can access it from anywhere. Just select the country like us or some other supported country in this image as you can see you can give like images of different things here for example there is like a donut there is like a robot and there is cat fiery cat and it's again when you give all these images you can give three things so you can give the subject and you can give a scene and you can give this style here is the style this was given and this was the actual prompt turn my these subjects into an action figure and use uh, personalized context of the item these subjects would like or use in their in their daily life and put it inside the figurine kit make the packaging of each action figure unique and tailored to the subject so as you can see it did exactly like that and uh, there were some issues with the text but overall it looks fine and that's where still open AI's image generation sh shines because the the subject is more accurate there and the text is also really great and the other thing is that you can just click on this refine button and you can change the image once you generate it and you also have this option where it will create like a random prompt and you can see that image that it generates so as you can see if you click again it will generate different prompts for you to uh, test out and you can also play with different aspect ratio like square portrait and landscape the thing that uh, made me do this video is basically because this is powered by imagine 4 i don't think there is any other service that google offers right now provides imagine 4 for free only here we can access the latest advanced image generation tool and that's why i wanted to do this video so you can get this for free and you can also convert video so if you are on a free account you can actually create 10 videos for free all you have to do is click on the animate button and it will animate it example image that i just created i created one image i wanted to change the dress color then i wanted her to have a google logo and as you can see it's stitched correctly here so if I open this into a new, as you can see, the quality is really good. And I just want to test whether it can do another logos as well. When I again asked to generate another image with the Canva logo, it created the Canva logo accurately as well. So that was really surprising. I thought Google would never create images with other brand logos. So that's something good to know. So I, I just want to share with you guys as well. For that, once you create the image, you just click on refine here and you can see, you can again add some changes here. So let's say put a hat on top and make her wear like aviator sun. So let's see how that looks. And the image generation is also really fast. She's wearing a hat right now and the a character consistency is also really great once you have that image what i mean is that if i upload an external image it only interrupt it as text first so it's have that text understanding it's not directly seeing that image directly once it's in the system then that image will be used as seed and you can have like good character consistency and as you can see you can go on and iterate and change whatever you need with this image uh, make it look dark at night
and seeing the stars in the sky so you don't have to be like a prompt engineer in order to work with this tool and that's their motto because if i just go here we believe you shouldn't have to learn how to prompt so you don't need to actually prompt in the back end it automatically enhance whatever you type in here in order to make the image re looks really great as you can see now uh, flying the plane at night and we can also see the stars here and if i want i can see the actual prompt that's going behind it and also i can just close it like this and if i want to animate it all i have to do is just click on this animate button she's flying the aircraft so i just need to give like a prompt on what that subject needs to do there with the image and this is using vo2 this is not actually using the latest vo3 model it's only available in google's ultra plan which is like 250 dollar per month we it's like we don't have that here and as you can see you get 10 generations video generation per month that's the current limit for free users so if i just play it right now i hope you understand how this works because it the video will be based on the first frame we cannot do much there that's how you generate videos and that's how you use the google's latest image in for i hope this video was helpful if you liked it please don't forget to share and subscribe for more future videos again thank you for watching and have a great day like share subscribe hey